Good evening. So a while back I did a Amazon $130 Salem Master Chainsaw video. Purchased it with my own money. Brought it home. Unboxed it. I've done several videos on it. And it's great saw. I love it. Well, I was contacted by the sales team from Salem Master. And they appreciated my videos so much that they wanted my feedback on their new saw. So, they have sent me the saw. I got home tonight and I was thrilled to death to find a package on my porch from Salem Master. And I'm getting ready to, I've already sneak peeked because I was too excited. So let's open it up, see what we got, and yeah, let's, let's play. So we'll get rid of our standard shipping box. And there was paper packed around it. Yeah, so it was packaged properly. Cushioned. So we got our Salem Sorry, Master 62cc with a 20 inch bar. Okay, open it up. Perfectly packaged. Everything's right where it should be. Take off our bar guard. Nice brand new chain bar. Low kickback, sprocket tip, just like you expect, just like their other saw I purchased. Nice brand new chain. I'm getting pecked by chickens. <laughs> Tool kit. With all of our standard tools. And our saw dogs that we need to put on. Okay, so that's all perfect. Exactly what I expect to see on the other one. Owner's manual. Daddy! Charlotte, I am making a video right Gotta now. Gotta wait. Okay. Set our little gas jug. Nice. For two cycle pre mixing if you want to. Here's our new monster. The box is empty. What is that? That's Daddy's new saw. That's Styrofoam out of the way me. before the chickens start eating it. <laughs> no. That's the uh, naughty chicken there. All right. Well, tell you what. This actually feels a lot heavier and a lot better made than the last one that I reviewed. That is it's got the full wrap thing. handle, chain brake, nice anti slip rubber. And I think that's actually aluminum casing instead of plastic. Very it's nice. Amazing. your air filter, your spark plug, everything looks brand new, perfect, clean, right off the showroom floor, Get your choke switch, start stop, okay let's get this put together here, again you can see no tools, all I'm using is what they give me, Charlotte, I amazing. don't need the commentary. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm, go play, baby. Go play. I'm watching. Okay, then you need to be quiet, okay? okay. Ah, our spring little chain break. Let's be activated. Okay. Uh, we got a little spacer there to keep it from rattling around during shipping. Got ahead of myself. Gotta remember that we want to put the dogs on. Dogs? What do they do? 
So when you're cutting, it'll dig into the log. Daddy. So you can get leverage. Mm, gotcha. Daddy. Well, sure. What does that thing mean? What, what is the name of the thingy mean? The dogs? The, the dogs. It's Therefore, what? digging into the log while you're cutting. Oh. I just said that. Okay, good. I don't really know what it is. Right, but that's why you got to listen, right? Okay. Okay. <coughs> that is a cool screwdriver. Mm -hmm. Try that. You just be quiet while I'm filming. A little bit of paint in these threads, but not too bad. There we go, now it's through. Just to be expected with a brand new item. You're gonna end up with paint and threads. There we go. That's the cutting part. The bad boy. Yes, the bad boy. <laughs> Ow. Very nice chain. Good quality. Very clean. Charlotte. quiet you will go away. Just finger snug, just to hold the bar down in place while you're adjusting your chain tension. And it's a brand new chain, I'm going to go a little bit on the snug side. It's going to stretch right away when you get it fired up. I just don't want it to have too much friction. There we go. Alright. 
Perfect. Charlotte. My little commentator over there is bored because of the shutdown and everything. She ain't exactly been out playing with all of her little girlfriends. So. Okay. Automatic brake, chain, okay. put some oil in. Don't mind the grass, it's just been sitting outside. Brand new jug, never been opened. No. We'll move over here so I don't get those nice clean boards that oily. You can put bar oil on? Huh? You can put bar oil on? That is bar oil. Okay. Oh, we got a sight glass on the fuel tank here. <coughs> Ooh, that's nice. That. Okay, and I got some 20 to 1 mix gas here. I said, see it says 25 to 1, but I like to run it a little heavy, especially on a brand new saw. And if you read the instruction book, it actually says 20 to 1 mix. I think that's enough. He's just going to fill it, maybe. This one's actually got a bigger tank than the other one. Yeah. So it's not quite a full tank. That's about half, three quarters. More than enough to start it. Okay. Put the choke on full. Ah, check air filter every 10 hours. Okay. Check and clean. So, okay. Come over here. On. Ah. So the choke has an automatic throttle catch. So you don't have to worry about your throttle catch. good chain brake work perfect and almost full throttle chain brake stop it instantly so very very nice saw here I'm gonna pause for one second I'll go grab my other saw and we'll compare the two side by side while you do that I'll get a quick video of just the saw And I'll sit up here now. It's amazing. You're really cool. How about that? It's, it's my papa. 
Baba says it a lot, so I I don't know about that. Mom, I want that to be done with his work. Pretty soon. It's amazing. It's very Look nice. Look that bad boy. <laughs> Power. Pro. It says pro. Yes, it does. Why does it say pro? Both of them look pretty nice. Okay. You can tell which one's been used the most. <laughs> Dogs. Poppy's out back. Are you still recording? Yes. I was getting a whole thing of this one. Okay, well. Okay. All right. So, side by side comparison. This is the one I bought. It is the 6220OF. This is 6220G. Exact same displacement saws, exact same size. They're both 62 cc, but you can see they made some improvements. So we got the exact same size bar. Obviously, like I said, I've been using this one. It's gone through 10 to 15 quarter of wood and still runs like a champ. Uh, they went to an aluminum side case instead of a plastic side case here. So that's nice. Uh, they changed. They changed from a toggle switch to a rocker style. I'm not sure if that's going to be better or worse. Instead of having a throttle catch for your throttle, they've incorporated it into the choke so it'll release. Um, it's a snap clip for the air cleaner rather than a screw on. This bar seems a little more stout. And the re reach around handle is actually a little bit nicer than this one. Yeah, that so that's that's a nice upgrade. The plastic on this one seems a little heavier, a little thicker. You can see it's a little bit thicker, a little bit heavier. So this saw is a, a touch heavier, but know, not much. Side by side comparison. They're probably within a pound, you know, so they're really close, which is nice because the old saw I'm used to weighed almost twice as much of these. So I could use this all day long and my back don't hurt. And I'm looking forward to that with this one. Uh, it looks like they actually went to a little stouter chain on this one. Can I I'll, it? I'll have to check the specs on it. This is the custom chain. You can see I've already gone through over half of this chain. This is a custom chain I get made down at the saw shop. So, I've got one really big round of wood over here. Let's uh, go give her a test. Okay, I got one really big piece of wood here that we can try cutting with. 20 inch bar. Not even going all the way through. We're at least 30 inches. And a little bit fatter that way. So, this will fully bury the bar. Give it 100% maximum power required.
grab a screwdriver, the carburetor's not quite set right. It's not grabbing full RPM. So now you're just going to adjust the carburetor? Yeah. I think that's a cutter. Nice, smooth, clean cut. And that is a piece of wood way bigger than that saw was ever designed to go through. And just a little bit of carburetor adjustment needed, that's it. And that could be strictly from one continent to another. So Salem Master, 6220G. can't say it enough you know it is this is marked the pro and there it is that'll hold up no problem